have been used by very many traditions to support pregnancy for a very long time. What does the research say? Is it by evidence or not? They do show some evidence of supporting labor, and this is one that because they're so nutritious, you can try without advice from your medical profession. That does not apply to you if you have concerns about blood sugar level. If you have diabetes or gestational diabetes, please speak to your doctor before trying this. When you're getting into labor, your body produces a hormone called oxytocin, which is very important during labor. What researchers have found is that they affect your oxytocin receptors. It impacts your uterine muscle and makes them more receptive to the oxytocin that your body is releasing. Data also have been used not just before labor to induce labor, but also during labor because they're a very high energy source and you need all the energy that you can get. Data nutrition. Research showed that Dates caused you to have shorter labor. Research showed a positive impact of dates on the length of the early phase of labor. It was short. And the speed with which your cervix, right? Women who went to hospital who had consumed dates versus the ones who had it, the ones who had consumed dates had a higher bishop score on admission. A bishop score is a way in which they measure the ripeness of your cervix. There's a couple of things that they're looking out for. To tell how ripe your cervix is and how ripe it is means whether it's ready for baby to come or not. It's measured on a scale of 0 to 13. And if it's below 6, then your cervix is not ripe. If it's above, then you know, people who had consumed dates in comparison to people who had them. When they were admitted in hospital, their bishop score was higher. The earliest phase of labor was shorter. However, there was no difference in terms of how long the active labor lasted or in any of the other factors. 